set of provision capital loss we know that if we incur capital gains we have to pay tax so what to do in case of capital loss in case of capital loss the government has given provision to set off the loss against gains so let us understand what it means see the first uh, provision capital loss can be set off only against capital gains it means that capital loss cannot be set off against other sources of income like business income or salary income etc so we have to set off capital loss only against capital gains and any unabsorbed loss that is say for example there is a loss of capital loss of 1 lakh and capital gain of only 75000 it means that still there is a loss of 25000 which remains not set off this loss is known as unabsorbed loss in such a scenario that loss can be carried forward for a period of 8 assessment years provided returns are filed on or before due date so let us understand more about set off provision in the coming video set off provision capital loss see short term loss can be adjusted or set off against short term capital gain or long term capital gain and similarly long term capital loss can be adjusted or set off only against long term capital gain we have given in a detailed manner say short term loss from equity segment can be set off against short term or long term equity gain or short term or long term non equity gain also similarly short term non equity loss that is loss from schemes other than equity schemes short term non equity loss can be set off against short term or long term equity gain or short term or long term non equity gain and let us come to the long term loss long term loss can be adjusted against long term capital gain so long term equity loss can be adjusted against long term equity gain or long term non equity gain similarly long term non equity loss that is loss from schemes other than equity it can be set off against long term equity gain or long term non equity gain so these are the provisions with respect to set off